Hello everyone, this is Jen and Teresa with iBrand Your Business. We are here uh, because we actually had a client ask us the other day about securing their password on Facebook uh, because they were afraid of getting hacked, their Facebook getting hacked. And we're like, great. Uh, and I realized that I don't, I personally don't have my Facebook uh, password protected. So Teresa uh, is gonna walk, walk me through how to protect my password. So you guys follow along and go get your password protected uh, today. So Teresa, what's the first thing I need to do? I'm logged into my profile, and then what do I do? Hi guys, okay, so what you wanna do is you wanna click on the little wrench on the right-hand side, and then you're gonna go to account settings. Okay. And then on awesome. the left, or on the left side, click on security. Got it. And then you'll see right there on the list, it says login approvals. Go ahead and click on edit again on the right side. And then you're gonna require a security code to access your account from an unknown browser. So what this does is that, let's just say that um, you're not on your laptop, you're not on your home computer, or you're not on your uh, regular mobile device. If someone from another place is trying to access your account, it's gonna send you a text message so you can put that text code in there and if they don't have the text code they just can't get in hmm. so that's really kind of cool then that that prevents some people from hacking into your facebook account. absolutely and i'm sure that hacking some of those that are listening to this have been hacked before yep. so all right let's get started yep all right so when you log in using a known browser you won't need to enter the code oh cool so we're going to say my laptop yep so okay. add that browser add that browser all right and then what kind of phone do you have Oh, so. iPhone, like there's any other weird <laughs> Android user. Hey, I like Android. <laughs> okay, so go ahead and, and if you don't have an Android, you can just click on, on other. Like if you if you're especially like if you, your kids they have the um just a regular phone. Oh that would it. be other. Other. Okay, okay, cool. So go ahead and click on continue. All right. And then you're gonna active you're gonna activate code generator. So you that's okay because they can send you the code through Facebook. Okay, so it says open the Facebook app on your phone. So that's what I'm doing, people. Can't see that part because it's not on the screen, but I'm opening it up. Uh, tap the menu button in the left corner, okay? And then scroll down and tap code generator. Code yep. generator, okay. It's on my iPhone, so that works. Mm -hmm. Scroll down, tap activate. Oh, yep. I feel like a... Um, what are, what are they? What are they called? Power Rangers. We put our rings together. We activate. Oh my goodness! <laughs> All right. It says <laughs> a new security code will appear every thirty seconds. Oh, awesome. Okay. So when code generator is activated, click continue. Okay. So she's got her code from her iPhone. So she's putting that in here. Got to hurry because I'm running out. I got nine seconds left. Yep. Oh, it said it worked. Woo yep. woo. And then if you ever can't use the code generator, then they'll just text it to you, okay? So don't worry about it. Oh, yeah, but you have to have a cell phone. Yep. You can't text the landlines. Okay, right. I'm good. All, All right. right. So then you put in your password. Make sure it's you. Okay, so for the next mm -hmm. text, for us to text your security codes, you need to add your mobile phone, okay? Yeah, so go ahead and put your mobile phone That's over. That's what I'm typing underneath all this blurriness. Send me a text, okay? So now they're going to send you a text, and you're going to put that in there. Okay. And then the code, the code that she had before, just so you know if it's an other phone, it you cannot turn that on. Um, you have to have an Android or an iPhone, but this part will work. So, hopefully that makes sense. Cool. Okay. And so then, um, whenever a login is attempted from an unknown browser, then they'll know to ask for a security code. Um, so you you don't want to do that. You want to enhance, or I'm sorry, start this right away. So mm -hmm. you want to click the no thanks. Okay, I want to do it. Yeah, yep. absolutely. And that's that's all you gotta do. Woohoo! All right. And so now you have your security code. Now now if, if she tries to log in from another computer that is not recognized, she's gonna get um, a code through her phone. She's gonna have to enter that code, and it and Facebook will ask you, do you want to? add this device as a, a device that you use to log into Facebook. 
If you say yes, then it won't ever ask you for that code again because you're adding that browser. So do it for your phone. Um, if you have your desktop, do it for your desktop. Um, and then just save it in there and then you don't have to do that again. You're, you're just automatically logged in. Oh, awesome. Okay. All right. Well, I feel all safe and protected. I hope you guys do. Uh, stay tuned for more awesome tutorial videos from iBrand Your Business. Have a great day. Bye, guys. Bye.